wanted to field, but I thought I thought I could come away with the win if I ran it really well. And and yeah, I just had to kind of run my own race. And I don't know what time it was. I did the first hundred, but I think it was pretty quick. And yeah, just ran my own thing. And when I got to the front two hundred to go, I thought I got to try and try and hold it and run as fast as I can. But I mean, you started off slowly, then you gradually moved up, and then you had an awful lot left. Yeah, well, I honestly, I honestly have no idea. Everybody at home will know how that race went better than I did. I just knew when I hit the front, I want to stay at the front. So, um, but no, I, I felt, I felt great. It's, this time of the season, it's a bit, it's a bit of an odd one because sometimes you can feel really good and, and then you run the race and you're a bit flat. So, but no, felt good today and excited for the next couple of races. I don't think you chose the wrong distance for a bit first. No, no, this, the, the girls there are fast. Yeah, it's, um, I can run like that, but the rounds is, is a different story, the 800 meter, even just making the finals very difficult. So, but it's exciting to have that ability over all the events. You need that 800 speed, 1500 as well. It's always an amazing atmosphere, it's true. Yeah, no, it's, it's fantastic. It's so nice to have, you know, full, full stadium um, and like a, a big atmosphere like that. It creates, uh, it creates a lot of noise and it's really nice. And you'll go to Brussels next week? Yeah, Brussels 1500 and then closing out with Eugene 1500 as well. So yeah, a couple more left. Thanks. I'm just curious, Laura, how, is, how have you kind of assessed the season where since indoors you've kind of been rocking and rolling, you know, obviously Budapest uh, didn't go exactly as planned, but you seem to still be having that stride. How you kind of yeah. assess the season? Yeah, I mean Budapest, like I'm really proud of how I ran it tactically. I think I ran it really well. It was just that that last 300 just wasn't in the legs. and. You know, just sometimes you don't have a have a great day, unfortunately. So yeah, it's just one of those ones. I ran it best I could, and that's all I can ask for myself each race. Um, and I did that today, and, and it came away with the win. So yeah, I'm, I'm super happy. I know I'm really fit at this point in the season, and I'm excited for the next couple of races. Yeah.